Championship 27, the, the penultimate ball. day of this quadruple header of action of Pro Tour stuff as the race to Outside. Minehead in the Players' Championship finals reaches its conclusion. And for a number of players, 25. they are fighting Alan's it out for the spots ball. at the World Championship and indeed to stay on the tour or get Alan on the to throw tour first. as well. And we have got our winner from the opening day here in Barnsley, Dave Chizzy Chisnell, a man who hit a record number of 180s, 35 of them in seven matches 96. of darts on his way to the title on Thursday. Against Alan Souter, a man who's been playing some excellent stuff this week, seems to have really jumped up a level or two in his form. 36. Two or three days that we've had so far in Barnsley. I'm Dan Dawson. Johnny Bryan's alongside me for this one as it's Chizzy and Suits, two of the least imaginative nicknames in darts, <laughs> but they do what they say on the team. 57. Well, last 64 tonight. Still a race to six, as you well know. 84. And Dave Chesnell, as you mentioned, Dan, in great form. Taking the first of the four players championships here in Barnsley on Thursday beating Josh Rock in that final 45 as you mentioned Suits has he's made the last four of a players championship this season as well and also that last 16 run in the world championships 180 early part of the year when Callum Ritz put him to the sword on that occasion yeah no answer to Callum Ritz in that game, 95. having found some heroic stuff to win the previous matches on his debut at Ali Pali, fighting against a particularly partisan crowd who did not 97. take kindly to his tartan trousers. But the man north of the border from Arbroath. Down to 88. After, oh, well, 120. Lower, and 88 he will remain on. Chizzy, 104 for an opening break. Can he find the trouble? No, he can't. Well, Suits has left 88. He should get 56. a dart at the bullseye, but even an extra 20 points in that bounce out would have made this easier. Would have guaranteed or should have guaranteed a dart at the outer ring, but he hits the treble and hits the shot. double, and he's made that look very, very simple. Maybe a little bit of justice done for Suits there. It suits Allen indeed with that early break of throw. Chisnell. 134. With the response in the second leg as he leads us off. The two trouble 19s. And one, three, four. But suits. 140. Respond to the ton 40. Oh, he averaged 99 in the first round, Allen Suits. A bit Kevin Doots. Yesterday he reached the quarterfinals with a series of averages 41. in the mid to high 90s and one up at 101 as well. He's played some of his best stuff these last couple of days and if he continues at that level then it wouldn't be that 60. much of a surprise to see him in the latter stages but there's no doubt that Dave Chisnell is one of the form players at the minute one on the European tour in Belgium Whoa, just the other week he is hitting 180s like they are going out of fashion And Suter respond with a 180 of his own, and that is indeed the case for the man from Arbroath. 180's galore so far. He's opening two legs. 55. Only 55 for Dave Chisnell. So Alan Suter here on 1-2-1. One, one. Treble, he fancies chances. He needs a treble now for the ball. He'll have a dart at the ball. This for two zip. Oh, Game yes, shot. sir. Two zip for Alan Suter. And Dave Chisnell will have something to think about. The champion from two days ago. 301 points cleared in two visits to the board from Alan Souter. And this is a special start from the fireman. 97. Still balancing his job with the fire service, with the demands of professional darts and the travelling all over the place. 100. 98. 42. 
Yeah, still got a little bit of a cushion, but it's a cushion that can be very quickly ripped away 56. by somebody with Dave Chisnell's scoring power. Doesn't manage to do it. Gonna go on the twenties here. Yeah, Ninety four. Managed to get to a finish. So Chisnell back on 290, he's going to need to find two travels here. There's one of them. Needs another one. Gets another 134. One. Down to a three dart out shot at 156. Suter, you'd maybe argue here, two visits at 170. To get a 3 0 lead. Trying to get down into double figures. 134. And a superb last start from the Scotsman. To lead 36. Chisnell under pressure. He'd love to have a go at 36 here. But he can't find the second treble he required. So Alan Suter likes this double, leaves it a lot. Hits Game it shot. a lot. It is 3 0 to Alan Suter. The fireman is on fire in this one. And Dave Chisnell has no idea how to douse the flames at the minute. Well, so far, Chisnell has gone to a double. Already had one nine data today. 60. Had one from Johnny Clayton earlier in the week. We saw Ryan Searle hit one earlier on and then mismatch darts and go out. Jose de Souza just missed the double 100. on the other streaming board for a nine data. Maybe he just didn't want to be accused of showing off. 58. So Chesnall needs to can his act together here. 100. Because he's been put under the cosh here from Suits. And Suter. Average has gone down and down to the mid 90s. A bit 43. Of a the right there from the Scotsman. He's only scored 161 after nine darts. You know, the thing is, Chizzy's trundling along at that mid 90s 59. average. But unfortunately for him, has found himself sat on finishes that he's been unable to take out in the first three legs. Suits is having a bit of a shocking leg, which is dragging his average down. But the first three, he was doing what was 95. required of him. So, I mean, we've saw, we saw one game this week as Dave Chisnell looks at another for double top for a 1-4-2. Doesn't pin it, but he will get more dots. Saw somebody win a game with an average 15 points lower than their opponent this, this week in Barnsley, which is about the biggest gap you're ever likely to see. Can happen. 46. Now, when you throw your good stuff. So Chisnell to reduce the deficit to two legs. Two fives. Game shot. Double five taken out for Chizzy. Holds his throw. And still trails by two. Has beaten Chizzy a couple of times as suits. We've only met three times before. 94. Chizzy won the big one at the UK Open. That was to get through to the quarterfinals last year. Won that by ten legs to eight. But the two meetings they've had in these kinds of events, one in Bolton, 81. one here in Barnsley, both last year, Suits managed to win them and played well on both occasions. I mean, even the UK Open one, he's got close, only losing 10-8. So he's, he's got good memories of beating the man in yellow. And at the minute, he's in pole position to do it again. 57 two legs clear just a couple of results to bring in Luke Humphreys he's advanced through winning six nil and um, Peter Wright also through by six legs to one over Danny Jansen of the Netherlands 85 Luke Humphreys just keeping up that miraculous form has taken so well on the European tour this season bringing a hit 100 well, it seems. yeah one won the very first one of these events this year that was the prelude to his dominance on the European tour he will go to the European Championship as the number one seed. 140. Suits again finding a two treble visit to put him really in control of the leg. Yeah, down to 48. 95. And Dave Chesnell leaving himself a bogey. So Alan Suter here, knowing he's going to have two bites of the cherry here, should he need it. There's the 12 for double 18, Game favourite shot. double. An old faithful has given Alan Suter a three leg lead. 4-1, he's two away from victory and taking a big scalp in Dave Chesnell.
Well, the finishing here from Alan Suter is absolutely magnificent. 88 taken out in two darts. 1-2-1 one, one completed on the bullseye. 36 pinned on double 18 and 48 pinned on double 18 first time of asking. By my reckon, is he he's four out of four. He's four for four indeed. 34. And, and in these, well, there is a confirmation for you, Dan. Well, not only is he four out of four, he's restricted Dave Chisnell to only having three darts at double. The grimace from Suits there is the wrong side of the wire. 53. And again, he's, he's in a position here where, look, if he has a bad leg on the scoring and it's on Dave Chisnell's throw, it doesn't really matter. 180. Another 280, though, for Dave Chisnell, his third of the match. Very much needed, but Alan Suter responds with one of his own to give Chisnell something to think about here with the Shanghai finish coming in. Needs the tops. 100. Doesn't get it. It's an outside opportunity. One, three, four. Plenty of routes to go here. And he's decided to go on the more orthodox. 44. Well, Chizzy. You don't want to let Alan Suter have Game a crack shot. at any kind of finish, to be honest, in the mood that he's in. So pins double ten, cuts the gap to two legs. But Alan Suter is only two legs away from round three. 140. Next is from the Arbroath native. And he's put his average back up now in the mid 90s. 60. There you go, 96.3. Dave Chisholm on 93. It's been a very good from Alan Suter so far, but door just slightly ajar here for Chisholm, who needs to find a break from somewhere. 96. It isn't a bad display from Chisholm, but it's not good enough to really be worrying Alan Suter right now. Look to the heavens from Suits there. 43. One strays into the one segment. And again, it's an opportunity for Chiz. Again, it's one that's not really jumped all over. It's okay. He's in the leg, but he's not bullying Suits with this scoring that he was certainly showing on the opening day. 100. Alan Suter does get himself down to a three-dart out shot. Chisnell needs to find a treble here. To give himself an opportunity. He finds one. A second one would be glorious. 96. But not on this occasion. It's going to be 153. So Alan Suter, 158. 20s to start it. There's one of them. Unlucky. 78 to go. Treble 18. We'll leave double 12. 134. The case, 24 left for Suter to go 5-2 ahead. Chisholm, 1-5-3. Treble 19. Again, it's one treble visits he's 93. getting, and he needs two treble visits. Alan Suter is yet to miss a dart at double. And Game he is shot. still absolutely flawless on the outer ring and the bullseye. That's included in that five out of five. He is shutting the door on Dave Chisnell every 100. single leg. And once again, it's a leg where Chizzy is right there waiting to pounce and Suter closes it out. That's why the average is actually pretty respectable from Chizzy and yet he has had so few opportunities 100. to win legs. Just five darts a double in seven legs. For Chesnaut and now he needs four on the spin to advance into the last 32. Oh, this the first of four chances for Alan Suter to win a leg and close out the 85. victory. And two of those legs, he will have the darts. This is just a free go for him, and Chizzy hitting a 180 and backing it up with... A 100. Ton means that Suter, like, it doesn't matter, there's no pressure. It's fine, you can have this leg, Chiz. He'll try and make it close, but it's only a 180 that he needs to leave a finish here. Well, he might get it, actually. Ooh, just a little shy with that last dart. Yeah, he's going to have two opportunities 
with throw to take out this tie, that is for sure. 53. Mm, that's what Dave Chisholm would have been looking for. He wanted to get down to a double there. 176. 240 would be glorious here for Suits. Mm, a very loose second half, though. 60. So Joe Chisnell to reduce the arrears to two legs. Eight or 16. It's the 16 for the double. Game shot. And that is 5 3. For Alan Suits, his first opportunity now to take out this tie with throw. Forty-six. An opening for Chiz. Fifty-eight. And every single time it looks like there's a real chance. Chizzy just isn't quite up to it. He's a treble sure every time. Fifty-seven. We saw a start from Alan Suter in one of the earlier legs. So it's very much the same calibre here in this ninth leg. He only scored 161 after nine. 96. Dave Chesnell, only with a 96. It's punishment, but not enough. Where are the trebles, Alan? Where are they? Where are they? He's going all over the board searching for them and can't find them. Dave Chisnell has been given the advantage in this leg, and it's not really about Chizzy's big score, and it's 59. about Alan Suter being unable to score anything. One big treble hit by a combina combination of both players in this leg so far. But Chisnell hasn't punished, and Alan Suter... 45. 12 darts, not one treble found. So Chisnell now will need to capitalise here. Finds one treble and a second one. 140. Is got by Chizzy. 148 now. And his favourite here to reduce the deficit to one leg. There they are. They were there all along, Alan. They were there all along. And he's down to the 116 that he didn't get a go at in the previous leg to win the match. And he will get a go at it this time around. And with the way that he's finished, one treble, which admittedly have been hard to come by in the early part of the leg, will afford him a match dart. And double 18 is probably where he wants to be looking. 116. He's going downstairs for 16 for double top for a 6 3 victory over Chisnell. That's his first dart missed in the match. I'm surprised. He didn't stay there for double 18 upstairs. Me too. Dave Chisnell's on double 18. He might have been worried about busting his score with that first dart in the treble 20. Game shot. And double 18 is there for Dave Chisnell. He has managed to break the suitor throw for the first time in this match, but he has had to survive a match dart to do it. And all of a sudden, Alan Suter, flawless on the doubles, could not miss them, misses his first one, and things are getting a little bit nervy. Thirty-seven. How do you respond? Knowing that Dave Chesnell now is just over your shoulder. Has the dart to this tenth leg to force a decider. Lackluster the first dart though from Chizzy. Good response for the second. Seventy-seven. Great first half from Suits, though. Second's pretty good. That was the third. That's not bad. Great cover. To take the four off as well, to leave 270. That's going to give Chisnell something to think about. Right back in the leg. 59. And a trebleless visit from Chiz. He wants to stay on the 20s, even though he's blocked it, because a ton gets into a finish. Well, how do you get there from the right hand side? Oh, that's 40. always the danger. So close to parity now in this leg. He's got to go 18 here, got to go across. 94. Gets the treble. To his credit, to leave 1 3 4. Suits it. And even an even 60 would leave an outshot here, but he's looking to better that, that is for sure. Treble isn't required. Knock 60. on, no.
It's on. It's still on. Double 16 for a 1 3 4. Yeah, Dave Chisnell, the professor. Five apiece. He has survived a match dart to lose this game 6 3. Alan Souter has the darts in a last leg decider, but this is a lot tighter than it might have been. Just intrigued here, Dan, just looking at the averages 59. again. You know, we mentioned about Chizzy, who'd just been hovering around the 94 95 mark. He stayed there, and Alan Souter now has just been going into reverse gear, and he's now in, in the mid 91s. 100. One and a half, in fact. So you'd argue realistically, Dave Chisnell here, it's his scoring that's kept him in this match in the last couple of legs, that's for sure. But this is how you score. This is how you get the average up. That's how you get the average up. Well, Alan Souter with another perfect scoring visit. He did have one of those in the last leg, of course, but he didn't capitalise upon it. He has got a 43-point cushion. Going on the 18s, sensible play. Oh, great play. Oh, well, OK, he doesn't manage to fill it up, but he is down to a finish after three visits to the board. Chesnell starts on 18s, and he's not going to get down to a finish. 80. And now Alan Souter here will have six darts at 150. He's got rid of 60 of it, 90 to go. Double 18, old faithful. 140. He'll be back. Well, Alan Souter nearly producing another suit special, winning a tight game with a massive checkout, just as he did a couple of times at Alexandra Palace. 65. But he has stood up to this comeback from Dave Chisnell. It looked like he was fading. It looked like he was wilting. They're not close. And 18. neither is that. How can you be perfect on the doubles for so long in the game and then miss five for the match? And those last three were not close. And Dave Chisnell, if he wins it with this, it is going to be such a difficult loss to take for Suter. 160. Suter will be back. Chisnell 49. only takes 49 off that 160 to leave 111. So Alan Suter, two ninths. Single one for double four. Gets it Game this time, and, and Alan Suter takes the big scalp of Dave Chisnell. An up and down affair, that is for sure. When one way went the other, Chisnell looked favourite going into that last leg. Alan Suter dug deep to get over the line and takes up the champion of two days ago. He advances into the last 32, beating Dave Chisnell by six legs to five. Toyo Tires. 